Oh my gosh, I'm doing great. Let me crank up your audio because you are quieter than church mice. There, maybe that'll do it. How's that? Still really quiet. Hang on, let me change my microphone. Okay. Oh wow, Elvis has the high score in this game. Man, I'm so jealous. Everybody say hi to Elvis, okay? Elvis played this game back in the day. He really enjoyed it, too. Okay. How is this? Oh, I think that's a bit better. Hello, Jeff. Hello. Yeah, Wait, I can hear you great. Familiar with cool. Oh, who's doing audio for us, by the way? No. Quick, man? Oh, my gosh. Okay, quick man's here. Okay, Alpha 5 is going to be doing audio for us. Thank you, Alpha 5. Uh, let me go ahead and change this so that I have that pulled up for you. Oh, Jeff. I've yes, never heard of the acorn. I hadn't either until recently. Oh, really? That's hopeful. <laughs> NPC, I see you sneaking in here as well. Yeah, he's gonna go commentate. Yeah, um, Jeff made me play this. Okay, Sorry. Jeff made you play this. Yeah, this music is gonna be fun for an hour. <laughs> Well, good. Good. Uh, I don't hear any music yet. That's okay. We'll hear it plenty in just a second. I really like all these thank you screens that are here, by the way. Like, I'm just watching them roll by, and he's really thankful for everybody who helped play this game. Oh my gosh. But how, how are you, NPC? Oh, NPC! Did you hear about Nest Cardinality taking the record for Back to the Future? That will be on there for a good long while. I could not be prouder for him. That is such a good time. Like That is insane. Yeah. Seriously, huge props to Nest Cardinality for blowing that time out of the water. I mean, it's improvable, but not by very much. That's the thing. Yeah. Yeah, that's what he I'm thinking. He played that game for almost a whole week. Oh my I gosh, I played Jeff. it for nine months. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, some of us have put a lot of time into that game. Okay. But I mean, it's the perfect RNG. What can you do? Yeah, pretty much, right? Uh, is anybody too quiet, by the way? Uh, chat, let us know. Does everyone sound good right now? Uh, is Jeff still a little bit too quiet? Please let us know. Oh, I like this music, NPC. This is good. <laughs> I liked it for a, a couple minutes. I like that. Apologies. And a special hi to everyone I know. Owning an acorn. So and so, that's it. <laughs> okay. So, what I'm gonna do is boost you two. We'll see how this works, okay? Uh, please let me know if this sounds too off balanced. But I think that I'm personally ready to start this game. I like bunnies. They're pretty awesome. I am so ready for this. <laughs> it's got a cute bunny, colorful graphics, good music. What could possibly go wrong? 
Oh my gosh. Uh, I think we're gonna find out pretty soon. Alpha 5 says that they are ready to begin. This is a very freeware game, apparently. I'm... I'm happy. Okay, just waiting for everybody else to say that they are ready. Do you know which screen they're starting on, Jeff? Uh, well, it is. Uh, there's a level selector screen, and so when they uh, hit enter on that, the game starts. Okay, should they go to the lever level select screen? Yes. Okay, cool. I'm just letting them know in there. I'm gonna watch until they're all at the same screen just so that we know. <laughs> okay, this is looking good. <laughs> he has no idea. doing the countdown now wish them the best of luck because they are here for our entertainment we're doomed oh I'm sure we are and there we go as soon as I see movement inside a stage I will start our timer okay <laughs> Oh, it starts. So, talk to me a little bit. What hey. is this? This is a game. Hey, Alpha 5 beat a stage. Stage one's pretty easy. Yeah, and stage... They, yeah. There is a dramatic curve in how difficult it gets. Okay. Huge difficulty curve. Ooh, Alpha 5 hitting... Wait, and you have limited lives? Of course. Yep. Oh my gosh. The 90s. They were cruel times. And we have collapsible floors. That's always a nice game feature. Oh, nice. <laughs> okay, this... So, here's the deal. I've never heard of this game. I hadn't even heard of Acorn until today. So, what inspired you to go find this game, Jeff? Well, I, uh, I, I've i done the Russian bootlegs, Chinese bootlegs. I wanted to get back to something, uh, well, I guess this one's British, I think. Um, yes. But, but something something in English. And, uh, and I thought, well, what, uh, what could I come up with that's even more obscure than the last couple of years? He just went through the platform! Alpha... F <laughs> I don't know how he did that. I really don't. Okay, oh. that was cool. Yeah, I guess if you hit escape, it quits the game. So. Ah. That looks like... That's uh, you're happening. controlling the car. I'm not sure what the plane is doing here. It's just flying around trying to bomb you or something. Yeah, pretty much the plane, if he touches you in a certain way or um, bombs you, it's an automatic death. Okay, gotcha. Whoa! I think the plane, like the, the angry son of Super Mario Brothers 3. <laughs> It looks like Plexel and Alpha 5 are trying to get through stage 2. Uh, the other two players, well, Devil Ray has made it past as well. Uh, High Spirits is having a bit of a struggle with the game at this moment, but honestly, I think we're going to see everybody struggle. So you said that this was going to be pure pain for them. Who? You did, NPC. Oh, yeah. I mean, the music, I turned it on today just to refresh myself, and I was just like, oh, no, I'm going to have to listen to this for an hour. Oh, yeah. That's what Kuso is all about. Oh, no, so, how sad. So let's start with the controls. Okay. Um, ZNX, move left. ZNX, move left. Okay. Left and right. And, left and right. And they are slippery controls. Okay. They just... It's just like very hard to control that car of yours. Mm -hmm. And then enter jumps. 
<laughs> I hate and, it so much. And space shoots. So you have to have your fingers all across the keyboard. That's so gross. Yeah, for being the only song on this game, I kind of like this. Look, I'm still saying it's better than Mega Man DOS where J is jump, okay? <laughs> but that's at least logical, right? J for jump. What is enter for? Not enter here. At least enter is a big button. <laughs> oh, geez. That's true, it is a big button. Alpha is putting me to shame right now. Oh, I'm yeah. just sucking compared to what he's been doing. He's blasting through this. <laughs> hey, oh, cool BBH, good to see you coming over. Uh, yeah, I guess this is a very special game. Oh my gosh, Alpha 5, that is, I think, one life left. So you get a password every... You cut out there, Jeff. You get a password every five levels. Okay. So if you die on level five and game over, like uh, like just happened to Alpha 5, then you're back to level one. Okay, so as soon as they beat level five, they get a password and it sort of locks in their progress. Devil Ray, how sad. No, Alpha just hit escape and left the game, which may actually be faster than like, letting the game over play. So, I can appreciate that strategy. Oh, you're with Devil Ray watching her play this garbage in person? Oh, baby. I hope you're enjoying it. <laughs> I like the kids screaming when you beat a level. Oh yeah, who, what kid wouldn't be enjoying themselves playing this game? I mean, it looks like MS Paint. Except a little bit sophisticated for MS Paint. This is like the Monet of 90s MS Paint, okay? Right here. <laughs> so this game has a website, sort of. It is... Uh... <laughs> It's technically still operational website. Yeah, Jeff showed it to me. It is on the Paul the Gay Appreciation Society website. Oh, baby. Um, and it, it, it lists such amazing features as sound effects and music. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I like and those. A nice level selector map type thing. That is exactly what it says on the website. You know, honestly, I'm just thinking, if you had this old computer sitting at home, you would be kind of excited to have a game like this come out, you know? It's like, hey, there's something that I can finally play. I mean, it's there not... There are actually a lot of games for this. Um, Wait, yeah, really? Them were... Yeah, most of them were things that were available on Vega and other systems. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I took a look at the Acorn. I look at a few um, YouTube videos, and they actually looked like some very good games were put on the Acorn. And I'd never even heard of it before. Okay, I actually have some lore. Do you want to know some of the lore here? Absolutely. Cool, the story so far. Poor old Elvis the Bunny really was having a bad hair day. If it wasn't bad enough for some unsavory character to spray uh, painted his lovely car in such an unappetizing pink color, they had also stolen all of his cabbages too. Well, Elvis was not best pleased and set off to find the culprit. Following the track of paw prints nearby, he soon reached the burrow of his arch rival, the evil Alfonso. All the evidence was there, the chewed cabbage leaves, the pots of pink paint in the corner. Elvis had caught Alfonso red pod. Oh boy. 
However, Alfonso wasn't going to give up that easily. He grabbed the remaining cabbages and jumped into his handily placed getaway plane and flew away. Elvis knew his mission, to catch up with Alfonso and rescue the stolen cabbages. Wow, so Alpha 5 finished level 5 and got a password. Nice. Now has to figure out the password system. Delicacy. Oh, there you go. Looks like he figured it out. Good. Well, the thing is, is that we we're having trouble, and it's because um, you have to hit the enter key very, very slightly. Because if you just hit it, it'll just randomly just go back to normal again. And oh yeah, you said that you password. had like a one frame window to enter the password in. <laughs> the password enter screen is a one frame track. You heard it here, folks. This is a real speed run. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, it's free to anybody that wants it. Oh my gosh, Alpha 5 is taking quite a few deaths on this. This level is significantly harder. Now, the thing is, some of the other players, you know, generally take a little while to warm up, so even though Alpha 5 is currently in the lead, anything could happen. Oh no, how sad. Okay, Alpha 5 moving on to level 7. The inverted pyramid level. Wow! This game is a butt. <laughs> the one thing that I don't really think that we've noticed so far, there is a time limit to each level, and it is not forgiving in the slightest. Yeah, I'm seeing that. Right now, Alpha 5 is waiting a while. I'm a bit concerned that they're going to run out of time, though. Or just die like that. Yeah, but that's the reason why most of them are just rushing to get through some of these stages is because the time limit is very short, so you really have to rush through all of these levels as best as you can. Oh man, one of the features of this is four layer parallax scrolling. Okay, now, now chat. List all four layers of the scrolling for us. Wait, part of the features here says that there are turnips and carrots galore, but I haven't seen a single turnip nor carrot. Oh, you're he's shooting, shooting carrots. carrots and he's dropping turnips. Okay. Exactly. I was about to say, you should... Oh, dang it. I ruined the joke. Never mind. I had it just ready to go and I just screwed it up. Oh, well. It's okay. That, that's what happens. So, I'm a little bit... I'm a little bit confused about this forum that I'm looking at. I see posts up through 2015? There are people still developing uh, things for this uh, ancient computer system, it ran on an operating system called RISC, R-I-S-C, like the, like the processor, the RISC yeah. OS. And so there's now finally a decent emulator for it, which is what uh, everybody's using. It took me like three days to figure out how to get it set up. But once I got it figured out, I was able to put it in a nice little zip file for everybody. So there isn't really uh, any setup involved. Uh, once you're done and uh, there's quite a lot of games that people are making for the risk operating system okay I gotcha yeah I'm, I'm trying to find out more about this guy uh, who developed it Phil Meller he's the developer here and it looks like uh, he's a professor of electrical engineering I'm wondering if this is the same guy. Yeah, I think that's right. I think I looked him up and that's what I found. Wow. Okay. That's pretty amazing. Phil Miller. Man. He's the benevolent dictator at TIB, beloved by puppies and small children. Oh no, that's somebody else. Okay. Uh, 
Yeah, this guy's not beloved by small children. Phil Meller's <laughs> bio says monkeys, monkeys, monkeys. <laughs> <laughs> That's all it says. That's all I know. Monkeys. <laughs> monkeys, monkeys, monkeys. Okay. <laughs> Let me see. He does have his own homepage, but I don't. It's probably not running anymore. We'll find out. Does it have monkeys on it? I don't know. It's trying to load. Uh, the homepage is monkeysun.info, but I, I think that it's a dead website. <laughs> Fine, it's not gonna load. Yeah, so, yeah seeing high spirits Plexal and Devil Ray play is exactly what I expected in how they were gonna be doing dying a lot and just trying to get to level five and die there a bunch. Alpha uh, Alpha is just getting through this like a champ. Good. Wait, 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 wait. I wonder. I found his deviant art page. <laughs> There's a deviant art page? He has a deviant art page, yes. Let's see what his newest picture is. I'm gonna be upset if it's not monkeys. Uh his icon is a monkey. <laughs> Okay, this was uploaded in 2011. Dang it! I want to find more information about this dude. Ugh. If he has a Twitter, I bet he'd love to see a race of this game. I'm, I'm trying to find him. Okay, that's it. Instead of Googling Phil Miller developer or Phil Miller bunny race, I'm doing Phil Miller monkey. <laughs> Let's see if this gets me anything. He's on Facebook. Oh boy. <gasps> I found him. What? Okay, he's he's pretty funny. I like him. Oh, he's on Pinterest as well. Okay. Like, I just need to find any information. I'm sorry, I don't... <laughs> stop stalking people? Okay, I'll stop stalking people, but I'll... No, he's a guy. His phone I like his stuff. And he's on Pinterest, okay? So, that's cool too. Uh, but anyways, he developed this game uh, for... The Acorn. Oh, Monkey Sun does appear to be his Twitter. Ha ha! Okay, I'm tweeting him. I need to share the love. <laughs> He's gonna, he does, he's probably gonna look this up tomorrow, see Twitter, and be like, what the heck happened? <laughs> probably, probably. Okay, there we go. Tweet is sent. There, I have established communication. But you know what? For somebody who's just making a game all by themselves, sure, this game uh, has some issues, but it's not... Like, Don't say it. No, it's, play, it's a playable game. It's not a bad game. It's just very difficult. This is the Battletoads of the Acorn Archimedes. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> the Battletoads of the Acorn. Oh, is anybody other than Alpha 5 going to be able to get past the first set of stages? I think so. What happened to High then? Spirits so. right there? He just fell to his death. And fell through the platform. Okay, Plexel moving on to level four. 
Uh, Devil Ray definitely made it to five. Good. Thank you, Mike Uyama. This is... This is not Dark Souls. Why would you even suggest that? <laughs> okay. Poor Alpha is just getting owned by this one little plane. He cannot jump across the platforms. Oh. I really want his website to work, but it just won't. Okay. That's fine. See, sort of what I love about this game, though, uh, it, it's got this cute style, it's colorful, and also, you know, they released it for free after a while, and was, were basically like, you know, anybody who wants to play this can play it. They knew that it was kind of ridiculous and silly. Uh, I, I would say that, yeah, the game has its fair share of problems, and it's ridiculously difficult. But, at the same time, it's got a charm. Yeah, it's really like A rabbit's point. foot? <laughs> no. Oh my gosh, <laughs> NPC, <laughs> why? Yeah, I like things that are, that are real colorful, and just kind of weird. Uh, but cutesy uh, and ridiculously hard. Um, I, I thought uh, so. This is my my second memorable bunny pick for this tournament. I think, uh, <laughs> after uh, wait and see, uh, my my competitors are always asking me like, I hope this is not Russian Bugs Bunny. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> yeah, it's better. It's, it's British. Yay, British! Everybody love the British because this is what they make. With that said, with our celebration of British culture in this stream, let me go ahead and take a look because we are probably announcing the next game pretty soon. So, NPC, uh, you say that the controls are a little bit slippery. What was your strategy for getting through some of these levels? Pray. Well, let me let me put it this way: that um, airplane bunny will move however it wants to, and it will it will kill you if it feels like it, and more than likely, it will feel like it. So I kept dying quite a bit. Well, don't die. Just don't do it. Oh my gosh. I couldn't get past level two, so that's why I needed somebody who's actually good at video games to, to test it out and make sure it actually worked. Jeff, whatever, you won Bible Buffet when That's we were playing. That's because I'm good at RNG. Well, good for you. No, that's RNGesus. Yeah. He's, He's good at both of those. Me. Oh my gosh. We're only 21 minutes into this, and I think we've learned everything that we can about this game. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I just want to see some of the later levels. I just want to see some of these later levels. Oh yeah, so do I. Like the dissolving platforms, fantastic, great. St oh geez, there goes Alpha Five. Yeah, because it's proving that these levels are not going to get any easier. Hey, Bersentra. Oh, if you, oh yes, Jeff. If you were having a good day and then you play this game, would that be Funny Race? Be what? Would it be Fun Race? Funny Race, Funny Race? Sure, yeah, that, that would be, yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> you ruined it. <laughs> oh, by the way, <laughs> if you- I spent all day on that for such a... Well, you should have done something more productive. <laughs> Uh, if you are in the next match, be sure to check in on Discord right now, okay? Right this very moment. <laughs> Today's new console day? Yeah, I told you, this is- the Acorn's a console. 
It was made for video games, obviously. So I don't, I don't know why when that platform seems to go up at a certain time, it seems that you just cannot land on it. It's not like it's a platform anymore. I'm, I'm watching Alpha 5, and it looks like you go behind the cloud. At least on stage 8. Oh, baby. Well, it looks like High Spirits is at level 5, so maybe he'll be able to get... He has all his lives on level 5, so hopefully he... Oh, that, that's he died. huge. He died. <laughs> Well, I mean, death happens in bunny race. You're not even racing, though. Bunny race 2000? Okay, You're that's a misleading clock. title, first off. You're racing against the clock. Oh, yeah, well, that's true. Oh, high spirits, you just gotta have confidence. The thing is, a lot of these, it looks like if you just go for it, you have a fairly good chance of getting forward, but if you hesitate at all, you may die. Poexel on to level 5 as well. Oh man, people are starting to catch up. But this is Poexel's last life. Let's see what he can do. Oh my gosh! No, Poexel, no! Oh! <laughs> oh. oh. Hey, here's the deal. People in chat who are complaining about the music. I play Back to the Future, so no excuse. And I play Back to the Future also. Yeah, two out of three of us play Back to the Future. Jeff, that means you need to play Back to the Future now. Jeff, you want to play Back to the Future? No, but I watch a lot of it. I watch... <laughs> I, I watched uh, most of Nespard's uh, eight hours. What the frick did that happen? Alpha just tried to miss the platform and yet it ended the stage. What? Oh, that's great. You know what? If you can die and end the stage at the same time, go for it, okay? Props to you, Buckaroo. I want to speed run the game just so I can keep doing that glitch. <laughs> By Cusa Grande standard, this music is fine. That's not saying much. <laughs> Psycho likes it better than the Gummy Bear game. Set. I, I agree with that. There's just so much death. <laughs> yeah. Devil Ray just died for no reason. Maybe it was time related? Yeah, it would have to have been time related. Alpha That's 5 really taking cool. it slow. Yeah. Oh, it looks like Kowal wants to run this. What? By all Why? means. By all it's means, a, go ahead. It's a free world record. It's a free world record. Nobody else has done a speed run of this game. NPC, you... Oh, Poexel, right through the platform. I see him laughing on his camera. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, I will be watching the Puexel stream after this, that's for sure. After Cusa Grande, of course. Whatever. I know that you're secretly just pulling his stream up and watching it. Well, I have to because I need to commentate about everybody's position in this game. Yeah, exactly. It's kind of your responsibility, Mr. NPC. Gosh, level six is so stressful for me. Probably more stressful for Alpha Five. <laughs> Just a little. So Jeff, I know that you have a few more games to choose before the end of the yes. tournament. Are we gonna get some more bizarreness like this? You'll, you'll definitely get some more bizarreness. I can't promise it'll be like this. It may be bizarre in different ways, but I have been trying to uh, pick a lot of different consoles. So, you know, the Turbo Graphics and Famicom and uh, Genesis, and 
I want to see how, and then this, uh, but I, I want to see people's uh, skills on different consoles and show off some of the, the gems on these different systems. Oh boy. Let's see. It looks like we're having a hard time getting everybody to respond for the next game. So uh, we'll keep going. Uh, let, let me know, Kate or Mike, if I need to poke anybody. I can throw carrots at them, okay? Bring their plane down. Actually, if they're on the plane, I probably just want to let them be. <laughs> I actually had to play a lot of Acorn Archimedes crummy games to come across this one. I hope everybody appreciates that. I would say this is bad, but it crosses into the territory of enjoyable. You haven't actually played it. Oh, for watching it. For watching it. This oh, is great. Watching, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, try to try and go for things that the, uh, the the racers will hate and the chat will love. Best of the worst? Uh, yeah, I again, there's that, like, reverse bell curve of enjoyment. Uh, the really good games or the really bad games are the ones that you enjoy the most. And this definitely goes in, it, it is enjoyable, at least to watch. Ah, it's so MS Painty. Oh no, Alpha 5! This game reminds me of like if uh, on Homestar Runner, if the cheat ever made a video game, this is what it would be. <laughs> the cheat is not dead. Holy crap, the cheat is not dead. The cheat is not dead. The claps, just the claps. Oh my gosh. I, uh, I love it. Homestar Runner is just, It'll never die in my heart. Team Bell Squad! Cheerleader! Apparently there's not much of the squad left. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, there's like, cheerleader! What was that? Like, no. I was going to say so-and-so, but I was waiting for the second. The, and, the, uh, and the ugly one! The ugly one! Yeah, okay good stuff yeah sorry we're, we're getting into old school 90s territory okay it's so appropriate for this game i though. feel sad like i teach college usually freshmen or sophomores and i'm pretty sure i can guarantee that some of them don't know homestar runner oh Homestar Runner's early two time. Okay, it's early 2000s. Whatever. Fine. It's just that the early 2000s feel like the 90s for me, you know? You know how it is? Okay, Plex will move it on to the next level. Yeah, the, the early 2000s were the... Like, 90s with the new game plus added onto it. Or, what, Justin? Yeah, I'd agree that the 90s are actually 95 to 2005. It's like, we're about five years off for everything. Hi, Justin! Hi, Justin. I still have one more good game for you. They're saying that hi. NPC said hi, and he has a game for you. He's not replying on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> Say hi to the red pandas for me. Okay. <laughs> I guess we will. Uh, yeah, we're going to go see red pandas this weekend.
Oh my gosh, high spirits! No! Look, you play hop about. You should. This is totally up your alley. Everybody oh, in chat is saying yeah, he, doesn't, well, just he doesn't play hair, he plays Swayzo, so that's why he's not doing so well. <laughs> okay, he's officially said hi to everyone except you, NPC. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, at like least I didn't give him Conan. That's, you know, something. I'm sorry. So what are the standings so far? I've seen Alpha 5 make it to level 8. Very briefly. Uh, yeah, Alpha 5 has been up to level 8 quite a few times now. Yeah, I've, I have, don't know if I've seen Devil Ray at level 5, but I've at least know, seen um, High Spirits and Huexo at level 5. Although I think that High Spirits has gotten farther than Quexel. Uh, um, Kowal, quick question. Have you confirmed that game with your players? Because if so, I'm happy to announce that. Justin, what? Ow, ow. Stop it. Ow. Oh my gosh. Justin, stop. He's abusing me, Jeff, NPC. Yes. Oh my gosh. No, ow! Ah! Okay. So it looks like we're still waiting for uh, Pezmerga and Mike's group to uh, confirm their game, but the game after that is pretty much confirmed and that is go ah, gonna be Monster Rancher Hop About because that's a cool what? game. What? It's gonna be Hop About. How? Really? Yeah. Oh, Lord. Why does Puexel keep falling through that platform? I don't know what's going on there. Yeah, that is... <laughs> that is strange. He's landed no, on bad it before, alpha. right? Bad Alpha. I wonder if his game is broken. But he's been to stage... 5. Yeah. You know, it may be worth them exiting the game and getting back into it the next time that the game over. If you want to give that as a suggestion, you could. What, Just, what is the issue? He keeps falling through a platform. For some reason, it's not solid anymore. Is it the platform going up and down? Oh, yeah. And High Spirits just did the same thing. <laughs> yeah, it's just, it's just one of those lovely little bugs in the game. Nothing you can do about it. Like Bugs Bunny. Oh, and there goes Alpha 5. Okay, platforms. The moving platforms are absolutely the worst in this. They're out to get you. Okay, they seem to be working now. Oh, yes. Make them play as Golem on Hopabout. That would totally be the best. <laughs> And something happened over on Devil Rays. Devil Ray. Oh, so that uh, that's unfortunate. That's the emulator not working. Oh no! It lasted over half an hour without breaking. That's something. That's pretty good. Yeah, it's well. This is something with certain. Uh, certain systems you never know exactly how stable they're going to be and i think everybody is pretty much aware uh of that devil ray though i don't think was too far into uh this set of levels so like it's a bummer but it's not going to be a run killer alpha five oh my gosh <laughs> no it does not like your keyboard <laughs> okay her hands are in pain her hands are in pain I'm sorry to say, I'm sorry to say, Alpha, it doesn't like anybody's keyboard. I like those bunny hopping strats. Get it? It's bunny hopping. Yeah, I, I, I got it. 
Oh, geez. Uh, let's see. Alpha 5 moving on to level 7. Ah, again, they've made it up to level 8. I believe Puexel, High Spirits, and Devil Ray have all made it to level 5. I'm not 100% sure about High Spirits, but I know Puexel and Devil Ray have. It's just that level. Considering that you have limited lives, it's brutal. You know, I, I was considering not giving this game because... What was well, that death? It um, is well known enough that there is one YouTube video where... <laughs> <laughs> I like Poexel's dying strats right there. It's a good idea to get a game over, uh, I would say. Oh my gosh. This game is just not doing them any favors. That airplane bunny is just showing them the business right now. Dude, that. Yeah, those turnips. Okay. There's a reason children hate turnips, because it murders them, okay? So if you're feeding your kids turn, if you have kids, first off, and you're feeding them turnips, maybe you should reconsider. Turnips are, are pretty deadly. I learned that uh, from Wart in Super Mario Brothers 3. You just touch a turnip and it's, it's like poison. That's two, isn't it? Two. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. I'll, I'll forgive you. I'm sorry. I was like, wait a sec. I don't know my Mario's. I just, I'm just here to talk. Oh, Jeff. Oh, come on, high spirits. Just get a little bit further. Oh, run, high spirits run, so close. Run, run, no. oh, Nope. One life left for high spirits. Let's see. Can he do it? I love that shooting the dude with the carrots just sends him down. Well, what else would happen to somebody getting hit with a carrot besides just slightly? Maybe they'd get too much vitamin A. Oh, Alpha is on level nine. Whoa. Oh, I am curious about this monstrosity. Well. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, That's there terrible. we go. That is so terrible. That is pretty butts. Oh my gosh, this game is so hard. <laughs> I'm not even playing it, and I'm like, wow, I'm sweating over here, okay? I was I was worried, uh, geez, is, is Alpha 5 going to be able to beat this game? Because uh, it seems like, hey, if you can you can get through three or four levels uh, in 15 minutes, you know, it's only a 20 level game. It's going gonna, it's gonna to last. Oh, yeah. Level 10. Oh, my gosh. Wow. That is a level. I don't think anybody on this planet has seen level 10. Well, now we have. <laughs> Oh, jeez. This game... Oh! This is so brutal. It's so brutal. Isn't it great? It's so cute. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's so brutal. Oh, maybe the guy who made it has seen it. You know? They've... Chad's got a good point. If you made the game, you may have seen the levels you created for it. Well, he may have uh, he may have seen it, but like I've made ROM hacks that I can't actually get to the levels that I've made. <laughs> Jeff, <laughs> you should ROM hack Bible Buffet, okay? Because then you'd be able to make it to those levels for sure. <laughs> oh, jeez. Devil, everybody's just dying. There's so much death. Bunny carnage, okay? Somebody has to get to level six. I, I am confident somebody's gonna get to level six. Please, please, Devil Ray, High Spirits, Puexel, somebody! 
because we really cannot have another um, baby boomer hell moment. Oh my gosh, uh, that was special. <laughs> I know Mike's still a little bit upset about that one. <laughs> We can hope, Mike, that this is not going to be the case. Oh, that was Baby Joe, not Baby Boomer. Oh, Baby Boomer! Oh, High Spirits game's over on level 5. Devil Ray still has two lives left, though. Well, <laughs> one. Okay. Game over, no! Nope. I feel like by the time I finish the sentence of how many lives they have left, it will have changed. Yeah. Oh! Quexel just fell to his death right away. Uh, Alpha 5, only one life left on level 8. He's gotten to level 10 before. Well, that's death. Yeah, like we said, people, this is a free world record. Yeah, if any of you want to speedrun this, have fun. You don't even have to speedrun it, just do a long play, okay? And then once I see that you did a long play and didn't put any effort, I'll go and take the world record for it. <laughs> NPC- oh, this is a good plan. Hmm. Because that's what happened with No Rules Get Fat. Oh my gosh, you can't say to put no effort into it. <laughs> NPC, uh, you are a butt. Presenta, can I paste a link to uh, where I uploaded this um, emulator and all that? Sure. Feel free to do that. Considering that this is available for free. Uh, well, it's it's and, the game plus the emulator. Yeah, Put it they, all into one package. The emulator is really hard to use. But with this, you just unzip it. And then you click um, RPC Emu Interpreter. If you click the other one, it makes a horrible noise but the, the interpreter one, then you're good to go. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah, thank you for getting it set up so that if people want to give this game a shot, they can. And uh, again, yeah, the developer did release it as freeware, so uh, you can get it guilt-free. Maybe a little guilt. I mean, this is a bunny race after all. <laughs> Okay, High Spirits on level 4, Devil Ray level 3, Plexel heading into level 4, Alpha 5 just level 9 because why not? I'm not sure how that death worked. That was cool. <laughs> oh, come on, Blasphemous Roar, you do Mystery Tournament. This should be right up your alley. I still I like the music, though. Really? Still? Give it another 15 minutes. Well, I can't because we only have 13 minutes and 40 seconds left. Yay! I can't stand the children, though. Oh! I'm not sure how that death worked, Plexel. Oh my gosh, I'm I'm really Devil Ray is on the level five. No, that is her last life. I'm gonna be starting the game over again. I think everybody hates you, Jeff, at this <laughs> point. It's okay though, okay? I have. I hate to admit it, but I think that I will be playing this some over the weekend, against my better judgment. <laughs> it's kind of addictive. Yeah. Quexel on level four. This is his last life, so he's got to be a little bit careful going into the end of this stage. If he wants to shut. Well, never mind. Uh, <laughs> how sad. I was apparently addicted to level 1, so it's the only level I played. Just over and over again. It's actually level 1's pretty easy. Uh, 
Okay, uh, we are still waiting on two people to confirm for the next game. Again, if you are Rain or Scratch Dragon, head on over to the Discord. Do it. Alpha 5. Uh, yeah, I like their quit the game and start it back up strats. Delicacy. Oh, baby. High spirits. I wonder how much he's going to appreciate that word. I badly want to find out what the level, 10, level 11 password is, so come on, Alpha. High Spirits has a lot of lives going into this stage. Well... Just hold on to those lives, High Spirits! Uh, Mike, I am completely fine with us uh, going without everybody if needed. Plexel! No! I'm kind of curious what this game is for Mike. I know what it is. <laughs> Come on, High Spirits, you're almost there. Yes! High Spirits did it! Nice! Did High Spirits! Next area. Yeah. Moving on to level so, 6. So we have an actual second place here. Yay! Now he gets to spend 10 minutes dying a lot. Alpha 5's having... I love the password entry screen, how difficult it is. Oh, now High Spirits is going to find out. Oh, he did first try, of course. Why is it so difficult? Acorn emulation, question mark? Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, Plexel is through level 3, moving on to level 4. Devil Ray currently on level 4. Oh, and that is a game over. Wow, we have 10 minutes left. Only 10 minutes. Oh, sweet, Mike. Glad to hear that everybody is around now. No, Plexel, also a game over. Devil Ray, Plexel, both have a chance to move in to third, maybe even second place. They just need to beat level five. That is currently their wall. Delicacy. There we go, high spirits. And beating the password boss again. Maybe it's just you two. As Alpha has trouble. Oh, Alpha is having trouble. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, I like it. Password boss is a tough boss. <laughs> what was that turn up on Plexels? It like fell along with him and finally killed him after like three seconds. So there are 20 levels to this game. <laughs> I don't know how you... And it takes, you know, one of the one of the best gamers in our tournament to get up to uh, ten. Wait, what word am I whispering? Am I whispering the word? Uh oh. Hopefully not. Yeah, there are twenty levels of this game. High spirits doing pretty good. On to level seven. Twenty levels of increasing difficulty. Yeah. For those platforms or something else. Apparently, I'm whispering fart and a D word. Probably like, oh, Charles Dickens. Ugh. Oh, delicacy. I keep saying delicacy. Uh, yeah, go it. Well, you know. I think that it would be unfair if they went and guessed it. Yeah, go ahead and purge them. Maybe. I don't know. What do you think, Jeff? Um, I don't, I don't think that's a problem. I mean, okay, Jeff says yeah. don't worry about it. Delicacy, they just have to get 
the password. Quaxel finishing the next stage. Just gotta beat level five. Okay, we he's got three lives. Devil Ray. Oh, jeez. On to level four. Quaxel has two lives now. Just gotta get that jump. Oh no! This is so hard. <laughs> no, Plexel! Oh, game over. There's still enough time to get back into this. Yeah, we may have to go back, depending on how Devil Ray and Plexel do, we may need to go back and check the VODs for them uh, to see who came in third and fourth. High Spirits, getting back into this, still significantly behind where Alpha 5 has gotten. Again, Alpha 5 has just amazed me with their gameplay. You know, I'd never really heard of them before the tournament, but holy cow, they're just plowing through so many of these games. Yeah, I know Alpha 5 through Mystery Tournament, so... Yeah, I know of their skill. Oh, okay. So they have a reputation over in Mystery Tournament as well, huh? Yeah, and also apparently my Cusa Grande skills have kind of gotten known over there too, so... <laughs> <laughs> well, good. Devil Ray on level 5, last life here. Wow, that was a really high bunny jump. Not sure how that worked, but that was cool. Yeah, I've seen occasionally no! they do high jumps. No! Oh, Puexel getting back into this. Devil Ray! Okay, I just got a text. I have to head off, so I'm sorry. Y'all okay. enjoy the rest of the bunny. <laughs> Thanks, oh, MPC. trust me, we will. Take it easy. So, percent, I just noticed you have this game set to Toxic Bunny. Uh, up arrow platform boost your jumps so you can get on it. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, yeah, I have it set to Toxic Bunny because guess what? I have no idea. Like, the game doesn't exist in the Twitch database here. Really? But what about the bunny race community? What are they supposed to do? There wasn't one until today. <laughs> oh, baby. So... We actually do have the next game chosen. Who we got? Uh, it's an Adams Family game. It's called Adams Family, and it's for Turbo Graphics CD. Oh, that's one I don't know. I do. <laughs> How does it stack up to the other Adams Family? It's it's different. Uh. Most of the other Adams Family games are fairly similar to each other. Yeah, uh, this one is not. <laughs> Can't wait. Turbo Graphics CD, yes. Ah, oh, Puexel just hurrying and running out of lives. I think they're all feeling that they need to make the push at this point. Yeah. High Spirits will have to see how good of a push he's able to do. This has also really got to be rough on everybody's hands. I mean, with the the ZX space and enter and grinding this for an hour. Yeah, I'm trying to think. Would I jump using my left thumb or would I shoot with my left thumb or my right thumb? I don't know. Well, you can find out. Well, I mean, I could, Jeff. <laughs> Devil Ray on to level four. Let's see if they're able to beat it and get back to level five. Plexel, I think, took a death there. High Spirits is game over. How sad indeed. Let's see if we can jump back into the del delicatessen. Okay, uh, High Spirits beat the password boss. Oh my gosh. I want either Devil Ray or Poexel or both of them to beat level 5. Please, no Devil Ray, that is a game over. And Poexel right through the platform. 
Because why not? The double spawn killed me. Oh, and not able to jump right there. Uh, Plexel, though, I think a little bit of work. Uh, if he doesn't fall through the platform this time, he may be able to uh, move on and get back to level 5. He's got to make this push, though. This is the last chance to move, or to guarantee that he is in... Aw, oh, double raise hands hurt. Oh no. Jeff, you're cruel! Uh, not my fault they just... Not my fault they chose to actually play the game. It is too, you chose it! <laughs> you chose the game! Yeah. <laughs> oh, Jeff! <laughs> no, Plexel! Last life! This is Plexel's last chance to solidify a place here. Now I'm... Oh, and that is death! I don't know if anybody else is going to be able to get back into this because we only have 45 seconds left. I'm wondering, though, who was in the lead, Quexel or Devil Ray? Because I don't know. I think we're going to go have to check the tapes, as they used to say back in the day. And there were these things called tapes. Yeah, this game is think. I don't know, depending on, hmm, it might hurt my hands if I'm playing this, I don't know. But yeah, this game definitely needed to have different controls, for sure. And here we go. Oh! Jeff, I just can't do it. It'll never happen. So close! I know! So close! The match is over, though! We are done! The, the timer final boss, you haven't beaten it yet. <laughs> but maybe you can beat the password boss. I beat the timer once, okay? Fantastic. So, um... Wow. I guess one of us, uh, somebody should go back and check the VOD, and then we'll let everybody know the final results are. Yeah, I'm still relatively sure Alpha 5 is first, High Spirit second, but third and fourth. Can they use Joy to key on future PC games? Yes. And X Keeper has asked if he, can, he or she can drop all the passwords in here. That seems fine if the match is done. Is that what they're talking about? Yeah, uh, okay, cool. Well, now we all know. Thank you for that, X-Keeper. But yeah, let me go ahead and let everybody know here. Unless otherwise stated, you may use Joy to Key uh, in order to make things a little bit more bearable for you. So, um, no, 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 no. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm generally <laughs> fine with it. But yeah, Jeff, thank you for this game. You're very welcome. I'm going to go back to sorting through a huge pile of Archimedes Acorn games, and I will see you all soon. Go, Jeff. Well, we are going to settle the difference between third and fourth uh, for this game later on. But yeah, congratulations, Alpha 5, for taking the victory, and High Spirits for taking second. That was a blast, okay? A blast and a half. Uh, I really support bunny video games. They're pretty awesome, okay? So, uh, everybody should go play that game at some point, just so you can tell how difficult this was for everyone, because this was uh, a jerk. <laughs> oh, boy. Alpha was trying level 16. Oh, well, you can go watch Alpha. It's fine. Hello, hello. Oh my gosh. 
Mike, I hear you. Uh, let me go ahead and fix this real quick. Hello, Mike. Hello, bro, Sencha. Oh, geez, I'm ready for the next game. Yeah, uh, you even played it, and you couldn't get past, what, the second screen? <laughs> don't talk no, about No, no, you got past things. the second screen. I, I think I might have. Yeah, on your first life, which is honestly not shameful because the game is really trolly and really stupid. So for those of you familiar with Adam's Family games, you know there's the NES and, incidentally, the Game Gear one, which has you playing as Gomez, you know, has Western characteristics, as in you're... You have no iframe, so if anything's hitting you, it's just hitting you a million times over, and it's really obtuse, and you have to find crap all over. And then there's the Super Nintendo, and I think also the Genesis version, which is actually a pretty decent platformer, which has you playing as like a a cheapy version of Gomez. And then there's a Turbo Graphics CD version, and you would assume that you would be playing as Gomez because he's the main character, and you know everyone. You know, we're all Julia had that standout performance in Adam's Family, and he really made Gomez. But no, you play as a lawyer, Holly <laughs> Alfred. <laughs> Dude, the lawyer was super important in the original movie. Okay. <laughs> That's true. I mean, he was the villain, if I remember correctly. Uh, you do. Yeah. So everybody loves lawyers, especially when they are being murdered. And trust me, there's going to be plenty of lawyer murdering in this. I'll, oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. I, sorry be. for any lawyers who are in chat, by the way. <laughs> Please accept my apology there. <laughs> uh, so, um, yeah. yeah I, and this is a little bit outside of Pismerga's wheelhouse, but when I offered the game up to him, because I thought this would be a good round five game, it's very evil, it's very stupid, You've played it, so you know what I mean. Oh, yeah. Uh, but Mike, every he, time he, that he I... Said th he, he said the game was total butts, and he was really looking forward to me uh, inflicting it upon the group. Oh, yeah, this game is bad. But, Mike, here's the deal. Every time I tried to play a game, you got super excited, and you're like, let me play, let me play. And well, so... yeah, I, did, I didn't play this one because I actually already beat it. It's actually a oh. very short game if you know what you're doing, but none of the players are going to know what they're doing, so it's it's going to be quite painful. I could see one of the players beating it, but um, once the match starts, I'll tell you why I think only one of them will possibly get there, and even then it's kind of unlikely. Okay. <laughs> yeah, this version is not Ocean. It's actually made by Icom Solutions, a.k.a. the people who brought you the Super Nintendo prototype of Batman Revenge of the Joker, the Green Dog, oh, baby. and and pretty much every U.S. developed TurboGrafx-16 game, including Yo Bro! Oh baby, oh <laughs> I love that game. Yeah. What, what a fantastic game. I mean, with that kind of resume, <laughs> you know it's gonna be good. 